Welcome. Today we are going to take a look at the Creepy Locations Iceberg. This is the second of the four-part series that takes a look at some of the most eerie locations on Earth. If you like this type of content and want to be notified when the next part drops, don't forget to like and subscribe. The Yungas Road, a thrilling 64-kilometer, or 40-mile, cycling route, connects La Paz to Bolivia's Yungas region, attracting 25,000 tourists annually. Known for its dramatic 3,500-meter, or 11,500-foot, descent, it's a hot spot for downhill mountain biking, despite its perilous reputation. Since 1998, at least 18 cyclists have tragically died on this notorious path. The Cotapata, Santa Barbara section replaced the old, 1930-built road, famously dubbed the Road of Death, for its treacherous slopes, narrow track, and lack of guardrails. Interestingly, unlike most of Bolivia, this road had left-hand traffic, offering drivers a clearer view of the perilous edge. The Capuchin Catacombs of Palermo, located in Sicily, Italy, are a fascinating yet eerie tourist attraction. These burial catacombs, known as Catacomb dei Cappuccini, offer visitors a macabre glimpse into history. Beneath the city lies an extraordinary collection of preserved bodies, dressed in their finest, dating back centuries. Each mummified figure tells a silent story of Palermo's past, making the catacombs a unique and chilling historical record. Despite their unsettling nature, the catacombs draw curious visitors from around the world eager to witness this rare and haunting glimpse into Sicilian heritage. The Sedlec Ossuary in the Czech Republic is a hauntingly beautiful Roman Catholic chapel beneath the Cemetery Church of All Saints. Located in Sedlec, a suburb of Kutna Ora, this ossuary contains the skeletons of 40,000 to 70,000 people, whose bones are artistically arranged as chapel decorations. Among its macabre attractions are four bell-shaped mounds, a chandelier featuring every human bone, garlands of skulls, and a bone coat of arms of the House of Schwarzenberg. Franisek Rint's bony signature adorns the entrance, contributing to the ossuary's allure, which draws over 200,000 visitors annually. Hanging coffins, perched on cliffs, are an ancient funeral practice found in China, Indonesia, and the Philippines. Known as Shuangguan in Mandarin, these coffins were created by various ethnic groups, including the Bo people of Sichuan and Yunnan. The Bo crafted coffins from single pieces of wood, placing them on beams, in caves, or on rock projections. In the Philippines, the Kankanay people of Sageda reserved hanging coffins for distinguished leaders, with coffins carved during the person's lifetime. The Taraja of Sulawesi also practiced this using boat-shaped coffins guarded by Tao Tao effigies to deter looters. Bielitz, a charming historic town in Brandenburg's Potsdam Middlemark district, is renowned for its white asparagus, famously known as Bielitzer Spargel. Each spring, the town transforms into a bustling hub of activity as locals and tourists alike flock to enjoy the celebrated harvest. This prized asparagus has put Bielitz on the culinary map, making it a must-visit destination for food enthusiasts. Beyond its asparagus fame, Bielitz offers a picturesque setting with its quaint streets, historic buildings, and lush landscapes, inviting visitors to savor both its flavors and its timeless charm. Kakam National Park, nestled in Ghana's central region, spans 375 square kilometers, or 145 square miles, of lush tropical forest. Originally a reserve in 1931, it became a national park in 1992 thanks to local community efforts. Unique for its 350-meter, or 1,150-foot, canopy walkway connecting seven treetops, Kakam offers a thrilling perspective of the forest. It shelters endangered species like the Diana monkey, giant bongo antelope, yellow-backed diker, and African elephant. Recognized as an important bird area, it boasts 266 bird species, including the white-breasted guinea fowl. With over 600 butterfly species, Kakam is a biodiversity hotspot, vying for UNESCO World Heritage status. Hashima Island, 
known as Gunkanjima or Battleship Island, is a hauntingly fascinating abandoned island off Nagasaki, Japan, about 15 kilometers from the city center. Among the 505 uninhabited islands in Nagasaki Prefecture, it stands out for its eerie, crumbling concrete buildings and encircling seawall. Once a bustling hub with undersea coal mines, Hashima saw its peak population of 5,259 in 1959. The mines closed in 1974, and the island was deserted. Rediscovered in the 2000s, it became a tourist attraction, spotlighting Japan's rapid industrialization and dark history of forced labor during World War II. Despite controversy, it was designated a UNESCO World Heritage Site in 2015. The Aijin Volcano Complex, straddling Banyuwangi and Bondowoso Regencies in East Java, Indonesia, is famous for its mesmerizing blue fire, acidic crater lake, and grueling sulfur mining. Nestled in the 20-kilometer wide Aijin Caldera, it features Gunung Merapi, or Mountain of Fire, as its highest peak. The Aijin Geopark, encompassing Mount Aijin, Palo Mera Beach, and Alas Perwo National Park, became a UNESCO Global Geopark in 2023. The Aijin Crater boasts a striking one-kilometer wide turquoise lake, the world's largest highly acidic crater lake. Sulfur miners earn about $13 a day, carrying heavy loads from the crater to the Paltooting Valley. Mansfield Correctional Institution, Mansi for short, is a mixed security state prison for men in Mansfield, Ohio, near the historic Ohio State Reformatory. Opened in 1990, it holds up to 2,523 inmates. In 2005, death row inmates were moved from Mansi to the Ohio State Penitentiary in Youngstown and later to Chillicothe Correctional Institution. In July 2013, prisoner James David Myers escaped using three ladders to climb security fences. He was captured the next day. The incident led to the firing of four employees for issues like falsifying inventory documents and not responding to fence alarms, highlighting significant security lapses. The Devil's Kettle, a mysterious feature on the Brule River, captivates visitors with its enigmatic disappearance of water into a pothole. Located 1.5 miles from the river's mouth, the eastern flow cascades over a 50-foot waterfall while the western flow vanishes into the devil's kettle itself. Legend claims objects tossed in, from sticks to even a car, never resurface downstream, fueling theories of underground passages or connections to distant watersheds. Recent experiments by the Minnesota DNR in 2016 revealed that the water re-enters the river below the falls, debunking the mystery. The Warren's Occult Museum founded in 1952 by paranormal investigators Ed and Lorraine Warren. Located in their home's basement, it houses a collection of artifacts linked to alleged paranormal events. Highlights include Annabelle, a notorious cursed raggedy and doll, alongside eerie items like a purported vampire's coffin and death curses. Despite its spooky ambience with red-lit displays and unsettling relics, Skeptics and believers alike are drawn to this curious slice of modern fascination with the supernatural. Whether you visit out of curiosity or belief, the Warrens Museum offers a captivating glimpse into their decades-long exploration of the unexplained. Delve into the mysteries of the Bell Witch Cave near Adams, Tennessee, where eerie tales intertwine with local lore. Stretching about 490 feet, this karst cave stands on land once owned by the haunted Bell family. Legend holds that the infamous Bell which sought refuge here after tormenting the Bells. According to one spooky account, young Betsy Bell and friends ventured into the cave, only to face a chilling rescue by an unseen force after a boy got stuck. While skeptics like Brian Dunning question its direct link to the original Bell Witch tales, visitors still flock for summer tours and October thrills. In the icy desolation of East Antarctica's McMurdo Dry Valleys lies Blood Falls, a striking crimson outflow from Taylor Glacier's iron oxide-tainted waters onto West Lake Bonnie. Discovered in 1911 by explorer Thomas Griffith Taylor, the falls initially puzzled with their red hue attributed to algae. Later, science revealed the true culprit, 
iron oxides leaching from a subglacial reservoir beneath 400 meters of ice. Hypersaline water sporadically emerges through fissures, painting the ice with a vivid reminder of Earth's hidden depths. Explore the enchanting Waitomo glowworm caves on New Zealand's North Island, where nature meets spectacle. Home to the unique Arachnocampa luminosa glowworms, these caves dazzle visitors with their bioluminescent displays. Step into a modern wooden visitor center before embarking on a guided tour that includes a serene boat ride beneath a galaxy of twinkling glowworms. The Waitomo Streamway System, encompassing Ruakuri Cave and others, adds to the allure with its natural wonders. Discover the magic of these illuminated caverns, where each flickering light tells a story of New Zealand's natural beauty and the marvels that lie beneath its surface. The Stone Forest, or Sherlin, in Yunnan Province, China, is a mesmerizing landscape of towering limestone formations spread across 500 square kilometers. Located 90 kilometers from Kunming, these rocks rise dramatically from the ground, resembling a forest of stone trees. This illusion of a petrified forest has captivated visitors for centuries. In 2007, parts of the Stone Forest, including the Naigu Stone Forest and Suojiai Village, were designated UNESCO World Heritage Sites as part of the South China Karst. Classified as a A-class tourist site, Sherlin offers a unique and enchanting natural wonder that leaves every visitor in awe. The Lost Gardens of Heligan near Mevigizi, Cornwall, are among the UK's most popular gardens. Created by the Tremaine family from the mid-18th to early 20th century, these gardens reflect the 19th century gardenesque style with diverse areas. Neglected after World War I, they were spectacularly restored in the 1990s, featured in TV shows and books. Highlights include ancient rhododendrons, an Italian garden, a subtropical jungle, Europe's only pineapple pit, and whimsical figures like the Mud Maid. Listed Grade II by Historic England, Heligan captivates with its enchanting blend of history and horticulture. Chindao Lake, or Thousand Island Lake, is a man-made wonder in Chunan County, Zhujiang Province, China, created in 1959 by the Exxonian River Hydroelectric Station. Beneath its serene waters lies the submerged ancient city of Shurqing, dating back to the Eastern Han Dynasty. Shurqing, once the county seat of Suiyin County, rests undisturbed at depths of 26 to 40 meters. The lake, formed by the 105-meter-tall Exxonian River Dam, also witnessed tragedy in 1994 when hijackers set a tourist boat ablaze, killing 32 passengers. Banger Fort Built in the 16th century in Rajasthan, India, by Bhagwant Das for his son Madho Singh, stands at the foot of the Irvali Hills near Sariska Reserve. Known for its eerie legends, it is said that a sadhu cursed the fort due to a shadow falling on his house, leading to its destruction. Another tale speaks of a black magic priest who cursed the village after his love potion was rejected by a princess. Today, visitors enter through gates leading to temples, palaces, and markets. The Boötes Void, or the Great Nothing, is a massive spherical region in space near the constellation Boötes. Discovered in 1981 by Robert Kirshner, it spans nearly 330 million light years across but contains only 60 galaxies, far fewer than the 2000 typically expected. This supervoid, one of the largest known in the visible universe, is centered 700 million light years from Earth. Its vast emptiness and size make it a fascinating cosmic anomaly. The Hercules supercluster lies on the void's near edge, adding to the mystery and intrigue surrounding this extraordinary expanse of almost nothingness. Trace 2b, or Kepler 1b, is an intriguing exoplanet orbiting the star GSC 03549-02811 located 750 light-years away. Discovered in 2011, it holds the title of the darkest known exoplanet, reflecting less than 1% of the light it receives, making its surface as black as charcoal. Trace, 2b is a gas giant similar in composition to Jupiter but much closer to its star, classifying it as a hot Jupiter. 
Within the Kepler spacecraft's field of view, this planet continues to fascinate scientists. Studies have refined its characteristics and revealed that Trace, too, is actually part of a binary star system. A pulsar is a highly magnetized, rotating neutron star emitting beams of electromagnetic radiation from its magnetic poles. This radiation is visible only when the beam points toward Earth, similar to a lighthouse's beam. Neutron stars are incredibly dense with short, regular rotational periods, resulting in precise intervals between pulses, ranging from milliseconds to seconds. Pulsars are potential sources of ultra-high-energy cosmic rays and are invaluable to astronomers. They confirmed the existence of gravitational radiation and led to the discovery of the first extrasolar planets in 1992. Remarkably, some pulsars keep time more accurately than atomic clocks. A quasar is an extremely luminous active galactic nucleus, AGN for short, powered by a supermassive black hole with a mass ranging from millions to billions of solar masses, surrounded by a gaseous accretion disk. The gas falling towards the black hole heats up and emits immense electromagnetic radiation. Quasars, among the brightest objects in the universe, can outshine entire galaxies like the Milky Way. Discovered in the 1950s as mysterious radio sources, quasars appear star-like but are found at galactic centers. The nearest quasar is 600 million light-years away, and the farthest discovered dates back to just 670 million years post-Big Bang. In geography, a pole of inaccessibility is the hardest-to-reach location in a given area. The oceanic pole of inaccessibility, known as Point Nemo, is the farthest point from any land, located at roughly here in the South Pacific Ocean. It's so remote that astronauts on the International Space Station are sometimes the closest humans. Point Nemo, named after Jules Verne's Captain Nemo, is surrounded by water for over 1,670 miles in every direction. This lifeless spot is also a spacecraft cemetery, where decommissioned satellites and space stations are sent to crash safely away from populated areas. Pine Gap, nestled 11 miles southwest of Alice Springs, is more than just an outback outpost. It's a high-stakes hub for global intelligence. Officially named the Joint Defense Facility Pine Gap since 1988, this joint U.S.-Australian base is crucial for satellite intelligence and signal surveillance. Operated by the CIA, NSA, and NRO, it's a nerve center for monitoring global communications, part of the controversial Echelon program. Despite its secretive mission, Pine Gap hasn't escaped scrutiny. Its presence sparks protests in Australia. Grossinger's Catskill Resort Hotel, nestled in New York's picturesque Catskill Mountains near Liberty, once thrived as a haven for Jewish vacationers from the bustling streets of New York City. Led by the legendary hostess Jenny Grossinger, it grew into a sprawling borscht belt icon, renowned for its kosher cuisine and vibrant entertainment. Over decades, it welcomed illustrious guests and earned a place in cultural memory. Sadly, its heyday faded, and by 1986, its doors closed. In a poignant twist, the remaining vestiges met a fiery end in 2022. Nestled in the serene hills of Gettysburg, Pennsylvania, the Farnsworth House and beckons travelers with its quaint charm and chilling tales. Built in 1810, it's not just a place to rest your head. It's a portal to the past, steeped in the echoes of the Battle of Gettysburg. Once a refuge for Confederate soldiers turned makeshift hospital, it now hosts a spectral menagerie. Soldiers on eternal patrol, a ghostly midwife, and even an ornery cook from yesteryear. In the heart of Topeka, Kansas, the echoes of history whisper through the now-vanished halls of the Topeka State Hospital once known ominously as the Topeka Insane Asylum. Founded in 1872 to shelter the mentally ill, it expanded in 1879 under the grand design of John G. Haskell, who also shaped the Kansas State Capitol. The hospital, aligned with the progressive Kirkbride plan, aimed for humane treatment amidst its Gothic architecture. By 1997, its solemn corridors fell silent as modern care took its place. Today, where patients once sought solace, Hummer Sports Park stands, 
a testament to changing times and fading echoes. Deep in the jungles of Belize lies Acton Tunakil Mucknall, better known as ATM, a mystical cave where ancient Maya secrets are etched into its limestone walls. Here, amidst shimmering formations, the eerie remains of sacrificial offerings whisper tales of the past. The most haunting sight is the Crystal Maiden, a young sacrifice calcified over centuries, her bones sparkling under the cave's dim light. Ceramics adorned with mystical kill holes hint at rituals long forgotten. Beyond artifacts, the cave teems with life. Bats flutter, while crabs and fish navigate its dark waters. Welcome to Nagoro Doll Village a quirky haven nestled in Japan's Aya Valley, where lifelike figures outnumber residents. Imagine strolling down Route 439, greeted not by people, but by hundreds of meticulously crafted dolls that populate streets, schools, and even bus stops. Created by local artist Tsukimi Ayano and others, these dolls depict former villagers and whimsical characters alike, frozen in everyday scenes like fishing by the river or waiting at a bus shelter. Once a bustling community, now a charming tourist spot, Nagoro captivates with its eerie yet endearing atmosphere. Nestled in the Finnish countryside lies the Vejo Ronkinen Sculpture Garden, a surreal wonderland of nearly 500 concrete figures crafted by the enigmatic artist himself over five decades. Ronkinen's creations range from eerie self-portraits frozen in yoga poses to towering tree-like structures adorned with cone-shaped branches. Each figure exudes a haunting charm, with hollow eyes, skeletal forms, and even the occasional use of real human teeth adding to their peculiar allure. Despite Ronkinen's reclusive nature, his garden now draws curious visitors seeking a glimpse into his eccentric world. Nestled along Canada's Arctic Ocean coast, the Smoking Hills offer a dramatic spectacle that has intrigued explorers since John Franklin's first encounter in 1826. These cliffs, named for the billowing clouds of smoke that continuously rise from burning oil shale deposits, create an eerie, almost mystical atmosphere. Over centuries, sulfur-rich lignite deposits ignite spontaneously, perpetually feeding the fires. The resulting sulfur dioxide has transformed nearby ponds into acidic, metal-laden pools, drastically altering their ecosystems. Perched on the northern edge of Glencoe, the Aeonic Egak proudly flaunts its Gaelic name meaning Notched Ridge. This daunting stretch of Scottish Highlands boasts two Monroe summits, Skernam Fionade and Meal Dirge, both over 3,000 feet high. Adventurers brave enough to traverse its rocky spine must navigate treacherous scrambles and precipitous drops into cliffs on either side. The slopes, disguised by grass and scree, conceal steep descents that challenge even the boldest climbers. With its rugged terrain and vertiginous vistas, the Aeonic Egak promises an exhilarating test for those seeking both adventure and awe-inspiring highland scenery. <laughs> Nestled near Huanchairi, Peru, Kweshwachaka stands as the last Inca rope bridge, defying time with its resilient grass ropes spanning the Aparimac River. While a modern bridge stands nearby, locals honor tradition by renewing this ancient marvel annually in June. Families from Chapabanda, Chakayua, Huanchairi, and Kalana Kehu weave grass ropes into cables and prepare mats for decking, a communal effort echoing the Inca tax tradition, MITA. Today, rebuilding serves as homage to ancestors and Pacamama, Earth Mother. Off the coast of Brazil lies Ilha de Queimada Grande, better known as Snake Island, a 43-hectare haven shrouded in mystery and danger. This isolated outpost teams with the critically endangered Golden Lance Head Pit Viper, evolved over millennia in splendid isolation. The island's perilous reputation is well-earned its rocky terrain and lush rainforests echoing with the slithering presence of these venomous serpents. Closed off to the public, access is strictly controlled by the Brazilian Navy and researchers, ensuring both human safety and the preservation of this unique species. 
Off the coast of the enchanting Republic of Mauritius lies a mesmerizing phenomenon known as the underwater waterfall. Though not a true cascade, this optical illusion captivates visitors with its surreal appearance. From above, it appears as if the island is draining into the ocean's depths, a breathtaking sight caused by sand and silt cascading down a steep underwater shelf. This illusion, visible best from the air or via helicopter tours, showcases nature's playful artistry. Nestled in the sweltering heart of Miami-Dade County, Coral Castle stands as a testament to both ingenuity and mystery. Crafted by the enigmatic Edward Leedskalman, this limestone marvel beckons with its colossal stones sculpted into fantastical shapes. A crescent moon, sturdy tables, and even a mystical sundial. Legends swirl like the Florida heat around Leedskalman, who supposedly summoned otherworldly powers to craft his masterpiece, employing secrets of reverse magnetism or supernatural strength. Today, Coral Castle continues to draw inquisitive tourists, offering a glimpse into a realm where the line between reality and folklore blurs beneath the relentless Florida sun. In a sleepy Australian town lies the saga of Dreamer's Gate, a colossal sculpture that straddles artistry and controversy. Conceived in 1993 by the enigmatic Fantastes, this 24-meter-long, 7-meter-high monument blends myth with reality, resembling a gothic castle ensnared in a giant arachnid's web. Inspired by his father's labor clearing the land, Fantastes intended it as homage to life, not morbidity. Yet, Bureaucratic battles plagued its creation, deemed structurally unsound, fined, and mired in a decade-long legal quagmire. Despite rusting and instability, Fantaste persists, defiantly fighting for his visionary creation to stand tall against time and authority. Nestled near Cluj-Napoca, Romania, the Hoya Forest beckons adventurers with more than just scenic trails and biking parks. It's a realm of spine-tingling mystery and eerie legends. Known as a hub for paranormal activity, this woodland has lured skeptics and believers alike. Tales of ghostly apparitions and inexplicable phenomena have made it a hotspot for thrill-seekers and TV crews alike. From Ghost Adventures to Expedition X with Josh Gates. Despite skepticism dismissing it as mere folklore, the forest's allure persists drawing curious visitors hoping to catch a glimpse of the unexplained. Whether truth or tall tale, Hoya Forest keeps its secrets well guarded. Perched near Dumbarton, Scotland, the picturesque Overtown Bridge hides a chilling mystery beneath its historic facade. Built in 1895, this architectural gem has earned a macabre nickname, the Dog Suicide Bridge. Since the 1950s, Reports abound of dogs leaping inexplicably from its heights, meeting tragic fates on the rocks below. Speculation swirls from eerie tales of paranormal influence to more mundane theories of natural accidents. Despite investigations and debates, the bridge remains a haunting enigma, drawing curious visitors and paranormal investigators alike. Whether due to supernatural forces or something else, Overtown Bridge keeps its secrets shrouded in mist and mystery. In the vast expanse of space, some stars spin faster than a whirlwind, shaping themselves into celestial oddities like pumpkins. Imagine a giant like KSW-71, an orange giant over 10 times larger than our sun, twirling on its axis every 5.5 days, while our sun takes a leisurely month. Discovered through NASA's Kepler and Swift missions, these stellar speed demons emit X-rays at mind-boggling levels, revealing their frenetic activity. They're the rock stars of the cosmos, flashing star spots, flares, and prominences that dazzle astronomers. Explore this cosmic dance in the skies of Cygnus and Lyra, where stars play spin the bottle with gravity's rules. In the vast expanse of cosmic highways, there lies a mysterious gravitational magnet known as the Great Attractor. Deep within the Lania Chaos Supercluster, it pulls the strings of over 100,000 galaxies, including our own Milky Way. Veiled behind the Milky Way's starry curtain and nestled within the zone of avoidance, 
this behemoth mass of about 10 to the power of 16 solar masses remains elusive to direct observation in visible light. Yet, its gravitational dance orchestrates the peculiar velocities of galaxies, tugging them towards its unseen embrace. A cosmic maestro in motion, the Great Attractor charts its course towards the Shapley supercluster, leaving astronomers in awe of its unseen sway. In the bustling district of Al Azizia, on the outskirts of Doha, Qatar, lies a tapestry of landmarks and initiatives that color the community. From the Qatar Center for Voluntary Activities, igniting the spirit of youth through massive volunteer events, to the Farij Azizia Stadium pulsing with sportsmanship on Al Wazel Street. Nearby, the Azizia Commercial Complex buzzes with commerce, while families find respite and fun at the Azizia Family Park on Al Andab Street. Healthcare meets modernity at the Azizia Medical Complex on Selwa Road, complemented by essential services from the Ministry of Interior and Qatar Charity. In the cosmic tapestry of Cepheus, the ghost nebula haunts the celestial canvas with its ethereal glow. Known formally as 2 to 136 shillings, or VDB 141, this reflection nebula hovers near the radiant cluster NGC 7023. Spanning over two light years, its ghostly presence is framed by a dark globule, cataloged as CB230. Embedded within our stars whose shimmering light gives the nebula its haunting yellowish-brown hue. Gazing at the adjacent image, the ghost nebula unveils its spectral beauty, a testament to the mysteries and wonders that dwell within the vast expanse of our universe. In a cosmic case of mistaken identity, NASA's Curiosity rover stirred up interplanetary intrigue by capturing an image on Mars that seemed to resemble a human thigh bone. The discovery sparked wild speculation across the internet, fueled by a UFO blog's claim. However, NASA swiftly debunked the Martian mystery, revealing the thigh bone to be nothing more than a weathered rock sculpted by eons of Martian erosion, likely wind or water. In a celestial twist of fate, 51 Pegasi B, affectionately known as Domitium, revolutionized our understanding of the cosmos as the pioneer hot Jupiter exoplanet. Situated a mere 50 light years away in the Pegasus constellation, this gas giant orbits its sun like star at a scorching pace, challenging conventional planetary norms. Its groundbreaking discovery in 1995 shattered astronomical boundaries catapulting researchers into the forefront of exoplanetary exploration. More recently, its atmosphere unveiled traces of water, adding a watery allure to its fiery reputation. As a cosmic tribute, the 2019 Nobel Prize in Physics acknowledged its pivotal role in expanding our cosmic horizons. Heart Island, a shadowy enigma in New York City's history, harbors tales of triumph, tragedy, and neglect across its one-mile stretch in the Bronx. From Civil War training grounds to a haunting potter's field, its evolution spans roles as diverse as a psychiatric asylum, a missile defense site, and a refuge for the homeless. Over a million souls, forgotten or forsaken, rest in its unmarked graves, tended by inmates until recent years. In 2019, a pivotal shift granted jurisdiction to the Parks Department, promising better access and transparency. Deep in the Costa Rican mountains, Sanatorio Duran tells a chilling tale of hope turned haunting. Founded by Dr. Carlos Duran Carton in 1918 to cure his daughter's tuberculosis, the sanatorium once echoed with prayers and the gentle footsteps of nuns. Despite their efforts, many lives succumbed to illness, leaving a spectral legacy. Ghostly apparitions of the Sisters of Charity and Restless Children are said to roam its corridors. Over time, the hospital's purpose shifted from healing to housing the mentally ill, then orphans, and finally inmates before the volcano's wrath sealed its fate. Nestled in Colorado's San Juan Mountains, La Guerrita Caldera hides a dramatic secret from Earth's fiery past. This ancient supervolcano once unleashed one of the planet's most colossal eruptions, rivaling the cataclysm that wiped out the dinosaurs. About 28 million years ago, it spewed the Fish Canyon Tuff, 
blanketing over 11,000 square miles with ash up to 330 feet thick. This eruption's magnitude dwarfs even modern benchmarks like Mount St. Helens, dwarfing its explosion by thousands of times. San Lucas Island, off Costa Rica's Puntarinas coast, echoes with tales of hardship and resilience etched into its rocky shores. Once a formidable prison, it housed criminals and exiles for 117 years, notorious for its harsh conditions and brutal treatments. The island's lore includes the haunting account penned by Jose Leon Sanchez, a former inmate, vividly capturing the island's grim reality. From its beginnings as a quarantine site to a penal colony, San Lucas bore witness to injustices, escapes, and enduring tales of survival amidst adversity. It was closed in 1991. In the depths of Abkhazia's Arabica Massif lies a cavern of superlative extremes, Varyovkina Cave. Plunging 2,223 meters, or 7,293 feet, into the earth, it reigns as the deepest known cave on our planet. Named after Alexander Varevkin, a daring caver who lost his life exploring similar depths, Varyovkina's labyrinthine passages challenge and fascinate spelunkers worldwide. From its modest discovery in 1968 to its record-setting descents in recent years, each expedition unveils new wonders, subhorizontal tunnels, ancient aquifer systems, and eerie discoveries frozen in time. In the scorching cosmic neighborhood of 55 Cancri E, a fascinating celestial drama unfolds. This super-Earth, akin to a fiery gemstone, orbits its sun-like star at breakneck speed, completing a year in less than a day. Its surface, baked to over 3,000 Kelvin, hints at extremes beyond Earth's wildest imaginings. Initially thought to be a hydrogen-helium haven, its atmosphere now teases with the possibility of heavier elements, or perhaps a carbon-rich shroud. Recent revelations from JWSD have added to the intrigue, unveiling hints of a robust atmosphere, a stark contrast to its rocky inferno. Hidden amidst the tranquil Venetian lagoon lies Povelia, an island steeped in eerie tales and chilling history. Once a bustling community, it fell silent when war forced its inhabitants to flee in 1379. But its darkest chapter began in 1776 as a quarantine station for plague victims, soon earning a grim reputation as a haven for suffering souls. Later, a mental asylum added to its macabre legacy until its closure in 1968. Now abandoned and off-limits to visitors, Povelia's crumbling ruins fuel ghostly legends. In the heart of Mexico's Durango Desert lies the enigmatic Mapamai Silent Zone, a place where reality and myth converge in a swirl of intrigue. Once a seabed of the ancient Tethys Ocean, it now hosts tales of eerie silence where radio signals vanish into thin air. Legends abound. Whispers of magnetic anomalies disrupting transmissions, mutated creatures, and even encounters with extraterrestrial beings. Fueled by a rocket mishap in 1970 that scattered Cobalt 57, tales of salted bombs and secretive cleanup operations only deepen the mystery. Nestled in the icy embrace of Uttarakhand's Himalayas, Rupkund, dubbed Mystery Lake or Skeleton Lake, beckons adventurers with its chilling tales. At over 5,000 meters, this glacial lake guards its secrets amidst jagged peaks and frozen solitude. Trekkers brave the thin air and rugged terrain to behold its eerie shores, where the remnants of past tragedies emerge with the thaw. Hundreds of ancient skeletons lie scattered, their haunting presence sparking legends of a lethal hailstorm centuries ago. Yet, recent studies unravel a more complex history, revealing multiple groups lost in time. One in 800 CE another in 1800 CE. Thank you for watching. If you like this video or found it interesting, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and check out one of these other ones. I'm sure you will like it.